where at the world's most famous dog show, Crafts, where the pick of canine breeds seek honour and everlasting glory. They have to put up with more than the judges' appraisive glances, the all-seeing eyes of batteries of cameras. Large dogs, small dogs, fat dogs, thin dogs, clean dogs, mm, and dirty dogs, all help to make it continuous variety. And to believe it or not, Mr. Cruft, the organiser, doesn't own one. Well, more cameramen. Fancy what cheek wanting to photograph me. In case your eyes are straying, these are Afghan hounds. As the guidebook says, hands is hands and dogs is dogs. And cameramen just hard-working bipeds. Here we have some fine specimens of the Alsatian, often referred to as wolf dogs, and sometimes as, uh, hello, what, more photographers? It's cameramen, cameramen everywhere. And when it isn't cameramen, then it's microphones, ready to catch every word between owner and entrant, such as instructions what to do when in front of the judge, and what not to do as well. Yes, it's one of the bulldog breed, and uh, this is a Bedlington. <coughs> Looks a trifle sheepish. Being a show dog isn't all honey, especially when you have to go strap hanging by the neck to look at your best. The judges are human after all. As one judge was heard to soliloquize during the parade of Dalmatians, we don't want your plum pudding. Mm -hmm. 